All right, it says, starting with the equilibrium reaction for any hypothetical acid, derive an expression that predicts the pH of solutions based on the concentration of acid and base in the solution. One of the ways that we can talk about weak acid, weak base solutions, particularly when there are nearly equal quantities or quantity, quantities of conjugate acid and conjugate base that are close to each other, what we have in those situations are buffers. And a buffer is a solution that resists changes in pH because there are both appreciable quantities of acid and base present in the solution. So any addition of acid will react with the base, any addition of base will react with the acid. And so what this problem is asking you to do is to derive, frankly, drive the, derive the Henderson-Hasselbach equation. So it says to start with the equilibrium expression for any hypothetical acid. Remember that's HA equilibriates with H plus and A minus, the conjugate base of HA. What it wants you to do is take the equilibrium expression and the equilibrium expression is Ka and that equals H plus times HA, or excuse me, times A minus and that's over HA. So the rest is some log tricks. And the reason we're gonna use log tricks is that we already know what to call uh, log functions of concentrations. And let's take a look and see how this works. Let's take the log of Ka on that side. And let's take the log of the other side as well. So again, you're going to need some algebra skills. And the algebra skills you're going to need is that the log of x times y equals log x plus log y. And so that's a, a log identity. And what we're going to do is we're going to use that log identity to simplify this equation. And so what we need is an X and a Y. And so here's my X, here's my Y, and I need to do the same thing with the expression from the equilibrium. Well, let's call this X and this Y, right? Because algebraically, H plus times the ratio is the same thing as H plus times H A, A minus over H A. And so now what I can do is I can separate that out and I can write log of Ka equals log of H plus plus the log of A minus over HA. And to simplify it even further, let's subtract the log of Ka from both sides, and let's subtract the log of H plus from both sides. So we end up with log, negative log of H plus equals negative log of Ka plus the log A minus over HA. And what do we call negative log of H plus. We have a name for that, pH. What do we call negative log of the Ka? We have a name for that, pKa. So I'm just gonna write the rest down. And so here is an expression that predicts the pH of a solution based on the concentration of acid and base in the solution. So the pH of a solution is equal to the pKa of the acid plus the log of the ratio of the base and acid in the solution. And this is the Henderson-Hasselbach equation. And you should use this anytime you get into a buffer situation.